So welcome back aliens. This is Navin Reddy from Telisco Learnings and in this video we'll talk about menu in Android. So what what we want to do here, so let, let's say we have an activity here, okay, we'll, we'll, we will not be building the same activity, it's just for a show purpose. So we have, you can see a three buttons there. So uh, if you're using an uh, Android phone, if you open an app like WhatsApp, so you, you have those three buttons there, right? And if you click on this button, you get option of update status, then we can set the, uh, we can go to account settings, right? So this is, this is your menu. So if you click on this, it will show you some options, right? And when you click on this, any of this button, it will do something for you. If I click on maybe other, other uh, menu, it will do something for you. Uh, so what we want to do here is we want to implement this menu. Okay, we'll not be building any one big application. It will be like a small demo where you have, we will, I will teach you how to use menu. Okay, when you click on this but menu, uh, like in, in this example, we are showing the uh, toast, right? Maybe you can call an activity, you can, uh, you can send the request to the server, you can do anything you want. Okay, so that's, that's a different thing. But I will show you how to create this menu and how to perform the actions here. So to do that, we'll create a new activity and we'll name this activity as main, I will say, let's create an activity. So we'll say activity, empty activity, and we'll name this as menu demo. So that will be the menu demo activity, right? And then we'll click on, we'll click on finish, nothing, oh, we, we want it to be launcher because as soon as I run this code, this, this, this is the file which I want to execute, right? And then when I click on finish, we got the okay so we got the project here so that's menu okay so we got menu here now how to create a menu so for that you have to uh, go to so in your res we have to go to this menu folder if, if it is not there you have to create your own uh, menu folder inside that you should have a file which is menu underscore main and if you open this there will be uh, some items so every item you have here so maybe if you don't have, so you have to create your own item here. So how to create an item? So if you have to mention item, then in item you will be having ID. So every uh, option in your menu will have a unique ID. Uh, then we have to mention the title. So let's copy this and we'll paste it here. And we want one more. So I will make this title as, okay, if you have to first change this thing, so we'll say, Okay, before this, let me set the title here. So this is settings. So we'll say this is settings. Okay, and the name is action setting, doesn't matter. We'll say this is, we'll remove this action settings. We'll say this is settings. That's one. The second one will say about. And okay, that should be small a. And this will say this is what? Um, so this is about. Oh, not this one. We'll say this is about. Okay, and here we'll say this is contact us. So we'll say this is contact. Okay, and even this, we need to change it to contact us. Now we can write anything we want, right? We can mention, uh, uh, we can mention Google Maps. You can introduce all those stuff here. But we, are, we want to keep it simple. So we have settings about and about us. So what it should do is if I run this code, it should, uh, it should expand. If I click on it, it should show these three options, settings, about and contact us. And if I click on about, it should show the a toast about me. If I click on contact us, it will show my uh, location or address. And if I, uh, if I click on settings, it, it will say now you can set the things. So we, we, we need to show, just show a test, a text right, or with, or with the help of toast. So, uh, so once we have created this menu, now let's use this menu inside your uh, inside your what menu or uh, inside your activity. So here to introduce this into an activity, we have to add two methods. Now these two methods are overridden methods from the app compact activity. To do that, right click on your uh, screen, just go to generate. And we need to override two methods. The two methods are the first one is on create option menu uh, that you will see. Let's type menu. It will filter out some things for us. So it is on create. So let's search for on create filter. Let's see on create option menu. It should be somewhere on create. Okay, let me type the entire thing. So it is on on create 
option menu. So that's that's the first method you have to uh, you have to select. The second one is on options item selected. So it is on options item selected. So we have to we have to override these two methods. One is for the menu, second is for menu item. And if you click on OK, it will give you those two methods. Now what we want is we want to include this main menu uh, activity, which is your uh, menu. We want to introduce this inside your job, inside your inside your activity, right? For that, we have to use something called as inflator. So as we have discussed in the last video, if you have seen that, uh, we talked about inflator, right? Which will fill the area. So inflate means fill. So we have to say it is main inflator which is the method we have to use it is main inflator so it uh, we can say main inflator object as inflator we can have any, any object name and the method name is get menu inflator which will give you the handle for the those three buttons and then we have to say inflator dot we need to inflate it with the help of this menu right so we, we have to use this menu here and how to use that we have to say r dot menu dot so there's a there's a activity name which is menu main comma you have to specify uh, this menu object here so which is your this is the handle for your menu and then everything is done so we'll return true because everything is working so we'll return true and if I run this code it should open an activity where I, where I should get these three options right if I run this code now let's see if it's working or not so it will take some time to load in my uh, window so it will let me just pause the video for the time okay it's okay where is the output okay I have changed the manifest so we have to make some changes in manifest we want the launcher activity uh, not this one so let me remove launcher here okay so we want the uh, we want our file to be on main right so let me run this again I think it should work now it will take some time to load okay so that's our activity here so we have an activity with a menu if I click on this button you can see we got three options we got settings we got about and we got contact us right so it's it's that simple so this is how you can introduce a menu inside in, in your activity but let's say if I click on this button nothing will happen right if I click on about about nothing is going on if I click on contact us nothing was there so every time you choose one item it it executes this method which is on options item selected so this is the method which executed every time you click on an item now we need to check which item was clicked so every time you click on item it will give you the, the name of the the name of the item so we can apply a switch case here and inside this switch case we can ask the item uh, give me the name of the item which has selected so it will so we can get that with the help of get item id and then we can pass this into a case so we'll say r dot if this case case matches with uh, what are the options we have uh, one is settings about and contact so we'll say dot settings if it matches settings we'll we'll give a toast again we can call an activity called as settings we can create an activity called as settings and then we can call the, that setting activity but time when we'll focus only on the toast we'll say make test on the same activity and it should display uh, now you can configure okay and then we'll give a comma we'll specify the length of the toast we'll say the length should be short or maybe we can also skip it long right and then at the end we have to say dot show so if that is one case so we'll if this is the case return true because we don't want to execu execute further otherwise we can use case r dot id dot second one is about so we'll say colon and we can use the same thing uh, same toast with a different text and we'll set this text as my name is Naveen Reddy so that's about me and the last case we can just copy this case here and paste it here and we can say this is instead of about we'll say this is contact and if you want to contact me, just go to www.telesco.com. Okay, so you'll find my profile there. Yeah, that's it. And yeah, now I think it will work. So if I run this code now, so it will take some time to load. So here we are, we have an activity. If I expand this now, 
it shows the same things. If I click on about, so you can see my name is Davin Reddy. If I click on contact us, we got www.telesco.com. And if I click on settings, we got now you can configure. So that's how we can use menu in our Android activity. So thanks for watching and do subscribe for other videos. And don't forget, if you have any questions, do comment.